has contributed to this concept. And as we begin with the pilot uh, project in Nakuru County, we believe we are going to look for how we cooperate or incorporate other counties across the country. Hans Pake, Chairman of the Frederick Nauman Foundation for Freedom Boat, and Principal Secretary Rosalind Jogu, once again signing the same MOUs. We kindly request if the President of the Republic of Kenya could join us for the photo session. As we focus on its potential, we must take note of Kenya's really remarkable digital transformation. Often referred to as a city savanna, Kenya has emerged as the leading hub of innovation in Africa. And this progress, I think, is a direct result of Kenya's forward-thinking policies and an investment in digital skills. This has positioned the country as a leader of digital talent in Africa. Today, businesses around the world are increasingly taking note of Kenya's skilled workforce, and many are already tapping into it. So now is an opportune moment for the German economy to intensify its relationship with Kenya businesses. And as you know, with the rapid digitalization of economies, comes the challenge of ensuring that we have the right talents to support and sustain the growth we have. The growing demand of skilled workers in Germany, particularly in the tech industry, presents an opportunity for collaboration with countries like Kenya, which boosts a young, educated workforce ready to contribute to remote work. The Kenyan digital economy, with its Flourishing sectors such as IT services, software development, and customer support offers unique opportunities for German businesses. Leveraging Kenya's highly skilled professionals through businesses process outsourcing addresses the pressing labor shortage that we have here in Germany. And it also fosters economic growth and innovation on both sides. Similarly, we will continue to provide platform for exchange and collaboration within the Kenyan-German digital dialogue. 